In Hollywood, the magic of cinema not only captivates audiences, but also has a profound effect on the personal lives of its stars. Betrayals, unexpected romances, and traumas. The film set is a conducive environment for both love and disillusionment. From passionate romances to painful separations, these are the stories of movies that ended relationships. Rachel Weisz and Daniel Craig met and fell in love during the filming of the movie Dream House in 2010. However, Rachel was married for nine years to director Darren Aronofsky at the time. Meanwhile, Craig was in the process of divorcing British actress Satsuki Mitchell. After the end of their respective relationships, Weiss and Craig started dating. They kept their relationship quite a discreet at the beginning, but in June 2011, just a few months after Weiss divorced Aronofsky, they got married in an intimate ceremony in New York. Andrew Garfield and Emma Stone formed one of the cutest couples in Hollywood in the last decade. They met on the set of The Amazing Spider-Man and followed the romantic footsteps of their characters. The scenario changed when Garfield joined the cast of Silence, directed by filmmaker Martin Scorsese. The actor's excessive dedication, which included abstaining from sex during preparation, bothered Stone, leading to the end of their relationship. Sean Penn and Charlize Theron were romantically linked for a few years. Their relationship began in mid-2013 after they had been friends for quite some time. The couple was seen together at various public events and red carpets, confirming their relationship status. They got engaged in 2014, the same year the production of the film The Last Face began. However, the bad atmosphere and tensions on set led to the end of their relationship a year after filming for the movie concluded. Another couple who ended their relationship during the filming of a movie was Johnny Depp and Amber Heard. They met on the set of The Rum Diary in 2011. At the time, both were in separate relationships. Johnny Depp was in a 14-year relationship with Vanessa Paradis, with whom he had two children. On the other hand, Amber Heard was in a relationship with photographer Tasia Van Rie. They eventually married in a private ceremony in 2015. However, the marriage was marked by controversy and turbulence. Johnny and Amber divorced in 2017 after allegations of abuse and violence made by the actress. Who could forget the couple formed by Robert Pattinson and Kristen Stewart, the protagonists of the Twilight Saga on the big screen? Despite all the fans' expectations, the relationship didn't last. The exact circumstances of the breakup were not fully disclosed publicly. However, shortly before the breakup, photos of Kristen with director Rupert Sanders were published, with whom she worked on the film Snow White and the Huntsman. These photos caused a major scandal in the media, as Sanders was married to model Liberty Ross. The scandal was enough to end the relationship with Pattinson and shake the filmmaker's marriage with the model. Brad Pitt and Jennifer Aniston's relationship came to an end in 2005 during the filming of the feature film Mr. and Mrs. Smith. Although the exact details of the reason for the breakup have never been completely confirmed by those involved, it is speculated that a series of factors contributed to the end of the marriage. Among these factors, differences in lifestyle, professional commitments, and possible involvement of Pitt with actress Angelina Jolie during the filming of the movie Standout. After the divorce, Pitt and Jolie were together for many years before also separating in 2016. The 2003 film Giggly was poorly received by the public, but the filming brought together Ben Affleck and Jennifer Lopez. Less than a year before, the actress had married choreographer Chris Judd. Within five months, she ended the relationship and began an engagement with her co-star from the movie. They got engaged in November 2002 but called off the wedding a few days before the planned ceremony in September 2003. After the breakup, Affleck married Jennifer Garner in June 2005, but they announced their separation in 2015. 
Paris Hilton and Nick Carter, a member of the boy band Backstreet Boys, had a relationship in mid-2003 and were together for approximately seven months. Besides drug problems, Nick saw his girlfriend leave him for Chad Michael Murray, who starred alongside her in the movie House of Wax. However, neither Hilton nor Murray ever officially confirmed a romantic relationship between them. Russell Crowe and Meg Ryan starred in the 2000 film Proof of Life. During that time, reports surfaced that the two were growing closer romantically, and there were speculations about a possible relationship between them. At the time, Meg Ryan was married to Dennis Quaid, but the relationship did not withstand the infidelity. However, the relationship between Crow and Ryan did not last long. Mia Farrow married Frank Sinatra in 1965. However, Mia had to make a decision. To star in the film Rosemary's Baby, directed by Roman Polanski, or to stay with her husband. The famous singer was not happy with the time demanded by the production and asked the actress to make a choice. Farrow chose to continue with the film, and Sinatra decided to file for divorce in the middle of the set. Mia Farrow continued her acting career, while Frank Sinatra remarried two more times after their divorce. James Cameron and Linda Hamilton met during the filming of the first movie, The Terminator, in 1984. Their relationship progressed, and they married in 1997. However, the marriage was short-lived, and they divorced in 1999. One of the reasons for the separation was that during the production of the director's biggest success, Titanic, he became enamored with Susie Amos. Although encounters between Amos and Cameron occurred before the film's release, Hamilton only announced the divorce eight days after the film's triumph at the Oscars. The film Cleopatra not only almost bankrupted the studio, but also brought together Elizabeth Taylor and Richard Burton. However, there was one problem. Both stars were committed to other people. The actor was with Sybil Christopher, while the actress had married singer Eddie Fisher. They both divorced their previous partners and began their relationship during filming. The story of the new couple was full of ups and downs, with a definitive end in 1976. Thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video and want to see more amazing content, please consider subscribing to our channel. Don't forget to hit that like button and share this video with your friends and family. Your support means the world to us, and it helps us continue creating fantastic videos like this one. Thanks again, and see you next time.